Kia ora mai tātou te whānau o Kaikui Baptist Church. May the Lord bless you and keep you uh, in this evening. Um, I'm down in uh, Auckland, Tamaki Makaurau, just finished um, teaching te reo um, at Kerry Baptist College and I just wanted to give you a little word for today and for tonight. Um, Job 33, there's a section in there that talks about our night sleeping and our dreams at night. That the Lord gives us dreams and instructions in our night time as parables, as warnings, um, as instruction for us in our day. Uh, I pray that uh, uh, if you just want to have a read of that, um, Job 33, have a read of it and, and maybe pray for about yourself, for yourselves. Um, it's been a long day for me. I had, uh, drove down this afternoon and I was praying for our church, praying for our community, uh, praying for the things that came out of our retreat um, over the weekend in relationship to um, knowing, growing, being and going. Um, lots of things have uh, popped up that uh, is encouraging. Um, I just want to bless you all for a um, You are the head and not the tail. You're highly favoured of the Lord. The Lord loves you. He blesses you. He's poured out His Spirit upon you. And as we talked about yesterday, He's continually filling us with His Holy Spirit. Um, as He said to um, Joshua when um, He took over the command of the Israelites from Moses, the Lord said to him, I will never leave you or forsake you. And then Jesus said to His disciples the same thing. Um, in this great commission to us, go out and make it all disciples, make disciples of all peoples, teaching them everything that I've commanded you, and I'll never leave you, and I'll always be with you. So, both to a leader of the past and from our king's words himself. So, keep pursuing him, keep seeking after him, and may the Lord bless you in your nighttime sleep tonight and over the next little while. May you find your night seasons, your parables at night um, of instruction, of warnings, of encouragement to be a blessing. And um, also that uh, you will find that the word of the Lord is becoming alive to you um, over this time. Well, uh, at Kerry College tomorrow for the opening, um, we will hold day here and then I'm back tomorrow night. Um, got a men's breakfast on, on Saturday, um, so all you men out there, um, love to catch up, um, so that's uh, Saturday morning I believe, um, and then uh, we're going out to one of the whānau to pray for her whare and out there. The Lord's is with us, the Lord's Spirit is with us as the promise of Pentecost, um, hold on to that whānau. Um, May the Lord bless you and keep you. May his face, face, oh, tired. May his face continually shine on you at this time. Um, to those that are struggling, to those that have got life issues they're facing, um, uh, I pray that the Lord will give you grace and mercy. We are victorious in him if we keep pressing into him and keep holding on to him. Even if it's like the the widow that had issue, issue, the lady that had issue, where all she did was just grab onto the corner of his gown and she, he said he felt the power of him leave. Um, in those times of struggle, let us take hold of the Lord and press into him. Bless you, Fano. Sleep well. Um, you are the head and not the tail. You are highly favoured and beloved of the Lord. Ngā mihi atu kia koutou.